Hello, friends. Remember last week we had our focus skill on plot, setting, and characters. Just for a refresher, the plot is what happens in the story. The setting tells where and when a story takes place, and the characters are the people and animals in a story. We're going to put this to use. In Blast Off that you read last week, so I'm going to go to Blast Off, and if I can have you look over here on this area right here, you have a box that says characters right here, and a box that says setting, and then a beginning, a middle, and an ending. Writing these things out. Can help you better understand and remember what you're reading. So, the characters will be easy for you to fill fill out. The setting, though, in Blast Off, what I like about this is the setting changes. So you're going to be writing two different types of settings. I'm not going to tell you. I know you're going to know from rereading the story. Then, on a piece of paper. I want you to write beginning and underline it, and put into some words what happens at the beginning of our story with our friends. And I don't want you to copy straight out of the story, but try to put into some words. Like for example,、um, Kim and Tyler went to the park with their mom and dad and climbed a rocket ship. The middle part. Now, that's more when I'll give you a clue. The setting changes, and that could be your middle. So you could talk about what happens, or what special fun words you learned when you were reading this story about、uh, Tyler and Kim's adventure. Then, at the ending, is when. Here's Kim looking at her watch, thinking, "Uh oh, it's time to go." So the ending is going to be something about how maybe what they brought back with them, what they did with their moms, and their moms, or maybe their mom's expression at the end, and how they went off to play again. So. I can put this on seesaw. A picture of the characters. I'll go back to the beginning here for you. The character settings and、um, beginning, middle, and ending. But if you just want to do it on paper that you have at home,、um, and just write out these words and underline them, and then underneath write those characters and settings, you can do that too. I hope you enjoy it, and I look forward to seeing them. Um, I want you to turn these in、uh, into seesaw for the teachers to look at.